and welcome to Luminex. In this video, we will take a look at the logging feature in Araneo. Araneo will constantly monitor the network and log any changes, warnings or errors with a timestamp. There are three levels of messages. Info messages, indicated by a white eye icon, which just provide you with general information about the network status and events like group changes on a port or less important information like a device that has joined or left a streaming ACN multicast stream. Warning messages indicated with an orange exclamation mark, which point you in the direction of an event or setting that might cause issues in the network like disconnected ports. And error messages that are indicated with a red X that will appear when something is wrong in the network or with hardware like switches that are no longer reachable or have a fan error. I've set up a simple network with a few switches and nodes. When we start up Araneo and check the log in the top right corner of the window, we'll see a bunch of info messages, one for each device that Araneo finds. If we unplug a port, we'll get a warning log entry. And if it's a device managed by Araneo, like a Luminode, it will also log an error message because the device is no longer reachable. We can search the log to find entries from a specific time or entries that include a certain port number or MAC address. Keep in mind that this field also works as a view filter. As long as there is something in the search field, only messages which contain this string will be shown. So make sure to clear the field when it is no longer needed. We can also choose to show or hide info, warning or error messages if we don't want to see some of the less important stuff. Plus, we can clear the log or save it as a JSON file. Another handy feature is the blacklist. If we're testing something on a port, and it involves a lot of connects and disconnects on that port, we don't want our log to be flooded with warnings and errors that we know that are not a big deal. We can add the port or gigacore description to the blacklist, and we can choose if we want to ignore the info, warning or error messages for that port keeping the log free from unwanted clutter. Any amainet 3 events will also be logged, as you can see in this recording. Feel free to tweak it further if needed. If you have any other requests, please let us know. Thank you for watching, and we will be back soon with more tutorials on the Luminex products.